I am at the Palos single track loop here in uh, Willow Springs, Illinois. Now this is a 9.7 mile single track site. And uh, as I pulled up, I see a bunch of people on mountain bikes, but today, well, we're gonna, we're gonna try to take this thing on this single track and see how well it does. Because, you know, Ingwe says that, well, this is a all terrain uh, mountain bike that's foldable. So we're gonna put it on a single track trail that I should probably not be on and see how it holds up. You got me feeling like a firebolt Hot in the sky Looking like a thunderstorm boy. Now, I have never been to this trail before, so I have no idea what to expect. I just know that I haven't seen anything even close to a bike like this on the trail. <laughs> oh, here we go. Now, I've lowered my seat some, and right now I have it on the power mode. But to me, the most sketchy part is gonna be this this, these handlebars and these stems because they're so high. Oh yeah, we're not doing that. Or are we? No, uh -uh. Don't wanna wreck this thing in the first 30 seconds of the video. <laughs> oh. Right now we are basically just using throttle only as we're cruising through here. These pedals, definitely not ideal for this type of riding. <laughs> hey, how's it going? <laughs> oh, the looks I get from other riders. You know, one thing you don't have to worry about is your handlebars. Because these are super short. <laughs> Ooh. Oh man, the cruise control got turned on on this thing. <laughs> oh, I, need to, I need to turn that off. I took my thumb off the throttle and we were still pushing forward. Let's go. I mean, come on, we just did, we did that. Now I have it in the power mode, which has given me all 750 uh, watts of power. Cause I do not know what kind of hills I'm gonna have ahead of me. Oh yeah. We're just scooting. We are just scooting around. We're doing it. Am I going the wrong way? Oh, this is uh, bi-directional. Got it. <laughs> Oh God! <laughs> I just did a willy coming off of that. This thing was torquing. Uh, <laughs> wow! I was like, I'm gonna bite it, but uh, somehow I kept it under control because I am an expert. Not true. Which is making me wonder. Like, will this thing get some air? I mean, I know the shocks can't handle it, but I mean, it's tempting. This is why I prefer a thumb throttle over a half twist throttle, because I can definitely control the power a lot more without having to worry about how I'm hanging on to the handlebars. I am loving these hydraulic brakes. You know, one thing I just realized that I haven't done is I haven't taken any air out of these tires. So they're rocking about 20 pounds of pressure. But uh, I mean, everything about this, uh, this experiment is not right anyway. So we're just gonna roll with it. Ooh, this, this, little, this little thing has no problem making these sharp turns. Ooh, we just did a little drop. Oh, people are eating it. You all right? Yeah. We're good. We're alive. Good. All right, man. Yeah. Take care. Take so I'm learning the terminology when somebody passed you saying solo, which is what I guess I should tell people because I am alone. Utterly, utterly alone. 
<laughs> yeah, come on, rock garden. Bring it. Oh, yeah. Ooh, oh, yeah. Ah, hoo, ha, hoo, ha, hoo, ha. <laughs> this is ridiculous, but I am having a freaking ball. Let's get, let's do these doubles. Come on, bring them, bring them. Come on. Uh, ooh, got the front wheel up. A little rock garden action here. Oh, we're not doing that. Uh uh. No. That's where these shocks would just totally like eat it. <laughs> I know, I'm just trying to figure out which way to go. I want to do something that this thing will survive. Probably not that way. I just came that way. <laughs> I didn't do that drop, but I. <laughs> so I want to make it a little bit challenging. Yeah, I don't think you'll have too much problem with, with the orange. Um, the black, you're going to get in some, some more difficulty with the black. With the yeah, orange. that's what I thought. That was a black trail, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, black meaning not black diamond, but black, it's going to be a little tougher. Good. I might hit the little tougher part then. Amen. Yeah. At least I know. Yeah. Yeah. So this is the black trail. They say it's a little bit tougher than the orange. And, uh, you know, if we're going to test it, let's freaking test it. Ooh. Let's go, let's go. There we go. Ooh. <laughs> oh, the front suspension didn't like that one. Ooh, yeah. See, that thing was gonna eat it. Oh, let's go, let's go. Yeah, I could tell the front shock didn't have near enough play to handle that at any kind of speed. Oh, I'm just powering through that. You know, sometimes you just have to give her the juice and go. Just hope for the best. Oh, that's... Uh, yeah, I had a feeling. Yeah. I had a feeling that little stop, the little leg, when you have it folded. I could tell that was going to hit that tree. Ooh. All right, we're just torquing through these. Uh, torque, torque, torque. <laughs> Ooh, I feel like you could just get bumped off right there. Go down that little gully. Okay. <laughs> Woo. There we go. This, uh, these, these hydraulic brakes are, I mean, they're, they're taking a licking, but they're doing great. Oh, see if I didn't have that metal piece sticking out. I don't know. I might be able to make that. Let's give it a shot. All right, we're gonna go ahead and give this thing a try and see how we do. Come on, baby. Oh, yes. Hello. <laughs> now we're starting to now I'm starting to get used to this bike Ooh. oh see look at that right through the trees normally on my other bike I would have been like thinking I wasn't going to make it through and I probably wouldn't have but but this one is not a problem there's some people riding over that I will not be doing that yep, look, boom right through Nice. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I have the back rack on this thing, the fenders. 
like just it's all, it's all together. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh. Right through. Uh, uh, uh. I am working the crap out of this suspension. These front shocks are like, what in the world? Thank you. Oh, shit. That was big. But I saved it. And this is pretty rooty all the way through here. That is okay. If this is your first time to my channel, just so you know, I am 54 years old. I'm 5'9", I weigh 220 pounds. And uh, yeah, I do uh, stupid things on electric bikes. You know, when I started off this, uh, this idea, thinking I, and knowing I was gonna come here, I was not too sure. Even when I got here, I was like, ooh, maybe I shouldn't do this. And I am having a ball. I almost cheated myself out of that. Are you kidding me? Whoop. Oh, <laughs> my chain's been off. Uh, my chain is, well, you know, this is a good spot to fix it. <laughs> the, the chain's about to fall off the bike. It almost came off to the pedal part. All right, let's fix this. Get in there. Ooh, come on. Good to go. Now, I did a full review on this bike um, in the city. And, you know, did a, a hill climb with it. And, you know, it kicked butt with that. But I figured, man, let's put it on a trail and see how it does. And I got this bike from my friends at geekbuying.com. Once again, this bike is impressing me a little bit. I wouldn't want to do, like this wouldn't be something that I would use all the time on a trail. But the fact that I'm doing it and it's surviving, well, that's, that's something. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, we got to pedal with that one. We're helping the motor, we're helping the motor. Ah, there we go. Whew. Another hill, pedal, help, help, help. And roots, and we're good. It's like that little engine that could. Ooh. I see why this is the more technical trail. Oh, we are definitely gonna have to tighten down some stuff once we're done here. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> That's where I would normally hit a tree right there with my shoulder. I felt like that was every time I'm on a trail. I always have that one second where I either feel like I'm going to hit it or, well, or I hit it. Oh, boy. Oh, that's 
big, that's big, that's big, that's big. Oh, the gears are not happy. Ah. Now I see why people cut across right there. Oh. How's it going? Good, good, how are you? Good, so far, yeah. th this thing's surviving. Huh. Oh, nice. Oh. Oh, 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 that chain's still on. Oh, the chain's still on. Ooh, pedal strike. Oh, back to back to not pedaling. Ooh, ah. oh, oh, oh. Uh, it wanted to a willy on me again. <laughs> I just did a little jump. <laughs> Nope. Uh, <laughs> uh, I would, I would, oh gosh, it makes me really want to go back and do that, but I will tear this bike up. And the goal is not to just destroy the bike purposely. The goal is to see if, can you survive this kind of stuff or can it survive this kind of, well, both really, to be honest. Take a look at a map here. Get an idea where we're at. Because we are at 51% battery power, well, 50% battery power now. And I need to figure out where I'm at. We're heading to another mountain bike. We started talking about the bike and I'm I'm letting him give it a shot. Well, that's it? You're done with it? You want me to keep going, man? I'm really happy. I, I'm going up to the, to the yellow trail, but there's a couple of uphills over here. Bad, oh, to you're gonna love that for an uphill. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, here's where he's gonna pull away. Ooh. One of us put in a little bit more effort going up that hill. I know, I was like, I'm just surprised. Because now I'm at like the end of my ride right now, so I'm like, this is great. <laughs> yeah, that acceleration on a pedal is quick. Yeah, it's, it's quick. It's spunky. I'm trying to keep up with him. Now I understand how it is when people try to keep up with me. Oh, yeah, I appreciate this pilot, man. Thank you. This is awesome. <laughs> Well, you know, I'm like, this bike's super light, oh, yeah. but I haven't been pedaling at all <laughs> with that one. I mean, I have, but the motor's kicking in, right? So it's not really, yeah. it's not really pedaling. Yeah. What's that? Sure. After the last hill. I appreciate it. Thank you. Of course, he wanted this last hill on it, leaving me on his. Is he gonna have a dropper seat post in this? Yeah, you okay? Did you make it up that hill fine? I'm an old man. Like I'm doing it for, I'm doing this one for this video, but there's no way that I would make that a, a thing. What? Like taking this, this on, taking this on trails all the time. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Adam is a nice guy. Uh, I let him ride the bike. Uh, he decided to ride up the three hills, <laughs> riding up these hills <laughs> without electricity. <laughs> Love my e-bikes. Love them. I mean, I did it. Obviously I'm healthy enough to do it. Um, not uh, not my preferred technique, I can tell you that for sure. 
So yeah, I figured I'd stop off, get some water. Um, right now I'm heading back because I don't know this area at all. And so I feel it's safe to try to make it back to where I parked since I'm not really sure where that is. And from there, well, you know, I think I've kind of proven the point that this bike can handle it. Um, I wouldn't want to do this all the time. Uh, I think if you take it out once or twice in its lifetime, then uh, you'll be fine. But yeah, man, I'm having a good time. <laughs> Uh, it's silly. It's silly. We are back on the road. Oh, that breeze feels great. It is like 83 degrees today. Heading back to the car, at least I think we are. And I've done this part of the trail. So we're just heading it the other way. Solo, it's just me. Thank you. Learning that mountain bike slang. Proper mountain bike etiquette. Ooh, ah, ooh. Just when this bike thought it was done with the abuse, well, gotta get home. Here we go, jump it. Uh, didn't have the speed for that. There we go, little rock gardens. You know, one thing I noticed about the uh, suspension on this bike, so the back, the rear suspension was tight when, uh, when I first got here, and now it is working extremely well. So we've got this puppy broken in and we are just, I mean, it's handling a lot better than what I thought it would. Ooh, I see people eating that tree a lot. Yeah, if this thing had one of the shorter um, stems on it with the BMX handlebars, oh, that would be a game changer. That take off the fenders and you'd have this little freaking nugget just tearing through these hills. Well, tearing through these trails, I don't know about big hills. <laughs> Sorry we that. did it. We, did we stopped. Ooh, it. Man, we both had hydraulic brakes. Whoa. That's right. Awesome. <laughs> no, dude, that's, right. it is what it is, bro. Have a good ride. All right, you too, man. Appreciate you. Now, if you're wondering who's wrong, well, if you remember when I was coming down this trail, some other people were coming up. So this is a two-way trail. Oh, remember me coming up this? Hoo ya! You know, that's why you always have to like look ahead. Because if you were just looking down at your front tire, he and I would have not seen each other and we would have just hit. That's where I came in. I'm like, oh yeah, and I thought about doing that with this, and there is no way. Uh, no. Uh, no. Whew. Hold on. All right, guys, we did it. We made it. I'm in one piece. The bike is in one piece. Uh, my watch said I did like a little bit over 10 miles here at Palos and uh, it's a really good time. I mean, I really enjoyed myself. Now, would I do that often with this bike? Absolutely not, right? I mean, I just wanted to see if it would survive and how it would handle and it did better than what I thought it would. So if this is the kind of bike that you're interested in, well, my buddies at geekbuying.com are the ones that hooked me up with this bike. So you can check the link below. And if we have any sales or discounts, all that stuff's gonna be in the description. I can't remember what it is, but I'm gonna put them all in there so that you can find out what you need about this bike. So I was checking out the bike, just giving it an inspection. I see this part right here, all right? So this has been getting in between there and rubbing and cutting it up a little bit. But if we just zip tie it to here, it'll be fine. So all I have to do is fix that with a little electrical tape. We're gonna zip tie it right here and that'll totally fix that problem so it doesn't continue to do that. I wanna thank you guys for watching the entire video. And until I see you again on my next adventure, enjoy the ride. Buddy, you need a bath.